all right guys welcome back to the channel as always good to have you back now yesterday i did a video on Alyssa milano she got absolutely destroyed on twitter after coming out trying to virtue signal that she was trading in her tesla for a volkswagen um and we all know how that went did not go well for her um surprised to see her on the view so soon but i'm very interested to see what they're going to be talking about here so don't forget to like comment share and subscribe while you're watching now let's get into it uh, you know, your name popped up over the weekend when you tweeted that you, you returned your Tesla. So um, you used to be a supporter of Elon Musk's vision. You see the way that they even frame it? All, the, all, the, all that they said is your name popped up. But your name popped up for what? The reason why it was so popular was because she made herself look like a fool. But, of course, they, they're just going to breeze right past that. I doubt they'll even mention that at all. Returned your Tesla. So um, you used to be a supporter of Elon Musk's vision. Yes. What happened? What changed your mind? Well, I mean, for me, speaking of me too, when he was accused of sexual misconduct and paid out $250,000 to this, to this person, I decided like I can't live in that hypocrisy of driving that car. All right, now I gotta pause real quick because first of all, I mean, she didn't say that he she didn't say that he um was that he was found guilty. She just said that he was accused of something. So it wasn't even proven. And second of all, let me go back to her Twitter really quick. Help me out here, guys, because I don't know these people. I don't know this guy, but I heard he's some sort of perv. And this dude here, this dude down here as well. So she's been she's she's been seen with and supporting questionable people so why does that energy only carry over to elon musk is my question but let's just go on car when you know yeah uh that happened but also i'm kind of like like I i'm so annoyed with all of these these billionaires with like the ex exception of a few but especially elon musk like you buy twitter to destroy it yeah for 40 billion dollars yeah. right 40 billion dollars buy twitter to destroy it twitter was twitter wasn't even a great twitter wasn't a great place when elon musk found it twitter was already terrible i don't even use twitter you guys but twitter was was twitter was a hellhole when elon musk found it so how is he buying it to destroy it you buy twitter to destroy it yeah for 40 billion dollars yeah. right 40 billion dollars elon musk imagine if he donated that money to unicef i know yeah he would oh. change the world there yeah. would be there would be no hunger he would he... is a there would be no hunger is a grown woman really this naive can we can we can we play that back billion dollars elon musk imagine if he donated that money to unicef i know yeah he would change the world there yeah. would be there would be no hunger he would he would that's just not how it works. See, you can donate. People have been donating to these to these nonprofits and these charities for 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 what over over a century now. Some of them, those companies, I, I'm not gonna name drop which companies, but I just know I know the nature of of a lot of those nonprofit businesses. That the money that you give to them does not go exactly where you think it is gonna go. It doesn't go to the intended person all the time. The, to, to the intended party all the time and they those companies they they survive off donations because they're a non-profit so you have to give them money so they could continue to eat as well so it's not like if you give money to unicef all 40 billion is going to go to hungry people that's not that's not how it works some of that money would definitely be taken he could go in his pocket and donate that money. He could go in his pocket and it wouldn't cost for. And, and I'm sorry, I know I'm, I'm pausing a lot, but every single lady up here, every single one of these women up here on the panel has over a million dollars in their bank account. So, you know what I'm saying? Why do, why do you need Elon Musk money so bad? You know, keep doing what you're doing. I know I know she's a part of UNICEF. Just keep doing what you're doing. Don't blame Elon Musk for not fixing world hunger. It's ridiculous. Forty billion, but these 40 billion. these guys. I mean, I, <laughs> by the way, it's, I have it's, a, there are loads of electric cars coming on the market. Mm -hmm. That's not the only and, one. And inexpensive ones as well. Uh -huh. Fairly inexpensive. Just saying. Um, I do have a legal note. Elon Musk has denied these allegations of sexual misconduct, calling them utterly untrue. Um, in your opinion, 
um, let me ask you this then. What happens if things continue the way they are on Twitter? I think it's become a hellscape, but it's been a hellscape for a minute. <laughs> I mean, I was always on the, the receiving end of Same. trolls, right? Yeah. So, like, to me, it doesn't feel any different. Mm. But, you know, I always open Twitter with, like, yeah. such, oh you know? Wait, hold up. So, so we're just going to go past that. We're just going to go right past it's that. Right? Yeah. So, like, to me, it doesn't feel any different. Mm. But She says that Twitter doesn't feel any different. If Twitter doesn't feel any different than what it felt like before, then what's the big deal? What are you complaining about? I, I, I'm not understanding it. If you've always been a victim of trolls or whatever, it don't matter who owns Twitter. Trolling will always take place. The main thing I see Elon Musk doing is getting rid of a lot of the, the, the woke staff and reinstating people's, people's um, accounts. You know, I always open Twitter with like, yeah. oh, you know what I mean, like with a helmet on because I'm so scared like something's going to oh, come yeah. out and hit me. Yeah. yeah. Um, Do you think you'll stay on it? Yeah, because we can't cede that territory. Mm. It's like a turf war now. Ah. That's no, how I look at it. And not, we can't, not I that, can't. Not that, that one you don't, there's other ones you can come and grab, leave that to them because that's what that is meant to be now. It's not meant to be any better. But if we're not we're representing seeing. our yeah. side of of the the mm. political discourse, aren't we aren't we just saying, you know what, you can have Twitter? You're handing well, it over. I'll tell you, some some things you have to walk away from until you can, can get the control you need of it. Right. right now, there's no way to get this control. Yeah. And so find the ones that you can get and fix. You know, this is so this is so telling. This is so telling. She said, walk away from it until you can get the control that you need to do something about it. So, oh, Elon Musk is there. So now you can't control. Now you're not going to have your way. So you're going to walk out and leave and wait for, and wait for it. Wait for your chance to strike again. And then come back and run that over. Right. But do yourself. I know it is about self-care. Yeah, yeah, it is. Self well, don't do read the comments, for one thing. Do not you read never, the ever read the comments. I always read the comments. Especially Especially no, she should have read the comments on her last post. She definitely should have. Who doesn't comments. read the comments? The comments Everybody get worse as comments. you go down the line. I know. You can never. I know. Whoopi and Joy taught us that. When Don't we read the jo comments. When we each join the show. Do you turn? This is ironically funny. I wonder if any one of these ladies sitting up here happens to know that. Happens to know that she just got roasted yesterday. Don't the comments off? No, I just don't read them. I'm not interested unless it's somebody that I respect. Yeah. Well, I have another question. I left. <laughs> Uh, she left. Yeah, yeah. I, I, she left. Because I thought I, I can't that. take it anymore. I respect you know? that. It's a Listen, I've spent many, many days with my therapist talking about about what Twitter and social media. anonymous person said to you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. And it's, Someone and it's who hurtful. doesn't know you. Yeah. Somebody who doesn't know you, hasn't yeah. met you, doesn't know your family, doesn't know you, doesn't know anything about you. Yeah. But we let them, we let them in and yeah. say, you have that power. Oh, it's the hell no. It's the accessibility. <laughs> yeah. It is. Yeah. Yeah. I stopped reading it when people came after my kids. Right. the way that I mothered. Right. And well, I stopped. Yeah. I was like, because I'm going to go out there and I'm going to find these people. And it's not like, <laughs> yeah, it's not it's like, it. it's just Liam so. You're a public figure. People will have something to say about you. End of the story. This I don't even know why this is a, why they even still talking about this. Yeah. It's just so accessible now. We are yeah. so accessible. Yeah. I mean, I always say people have been trying to cancel me from the 80s, mm -hmm. but they had to do it through fan mail. Yeah. Right? Like, they had to, like, <laughs> to yeah. mail me a letter. Yeah, they had yeah. to mail yeah. me a letter to tell me they're. Who is trying to cancel Alyssa Milano? I, all right, you guys, on that note, I think I'm going to end the video right here because they're, they're, they're really just up there chatting at this point. But yes, as we've seen, they did not mention the fact that she got roasted yesterday. Let's just go down memory lane really quick. Let's just go down memory lane one more time. I want to see the Hodge Twins tweet. Yep, there it is. Oh, she said, I gave back my Tesla. I bought the Volkswagen EV. I love it. I'm not sure how advertisers can buy space on Twitter. Publicly traded companies' products being pushed in alignment with hate and white supremacy doesn't seem to be a winning business model. Volkswagen was literally, literally founded by the Nazis and Hitler. Oh, man. Let me be on the view. This would have been the first thing I brought up. She wouldn't have been able to get around the elephant in the room. It would have been so big. But that's it for the video, you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe on your way out the door. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.